Brody King challenging John Moxley for the AEW Interim World Championship. And as we saw in picture in picture, Brody King has turned this around on the champion, Taz. Been in big time control. King has. Mox still has been fighting his ass off, but it's just not enough. Here's a man with a... Every one of those elbows precisely to the point of the chin. And Brody King's just, just weathering the storm here. He's just eating them, to your point. Oh, but Moxley escapes to his feet. Moxley's got to make a, uh -oh. a oh. huge comeback oh. here. Oh. And count on Brody King to miss something, oh. to make a mistake. He just got the mistake handed to him. And remember, we're going to stay with the action as long as it takes. Stay with us here in this main event. The oh. cannonball sent on in the corner. The, great, the great thing about John Moxley is as wily as a fox. He's a streetwise competitor with a skill set that is unmatched. But he's got to keep out the way of this huge monster. Eyes tell the story right there, JR. You saw the eyes of Mox, that look. It's a, it's a nasty look. Yeah, he's very coherent, believe it or not. He knows what he's, where he is. He knows what he wants to do. The question is, how can a man Moxley size who's given up all this weight 54 pounds and poses with Moxley. He's doing it here. Looking perhaps for the superplex. Maybe the Avalanche Paradise. Oh, God. Moxley with so many weapons from the top, but now then taking the fingernails, biting. Clawing, oh, biting. Do what you got to do. Do what you've got to do. Big exactly. superplex here. Whoa. Big power by Mox. Mox looking for something big. Oh, Mox looking for the, the bulldog. bulldog choke, yeah. Locking in that choke, and look how he's got that arm right. It's locked into the shoulder blade. But I, I'm sure he did not want King to get to a vertical base. Yeah, that's the, the great counter-wrestling by Brody King. Uh oh And now, oh! oh! A, I think he went for, I think it was a dragon suplex. He didn't have the full Nelson locked in. It looked like the underhook, though. It was, it was a release dragon, and now Moxley shoots the half into the, into the cover. One, two, no! Too right. much power, too yeah. much left in the tank. For this Ooh. big man who's in the biggest match of his life. He's fixing the cauliflower out here. And he's <laughs> very smart use of the pin there, though, by John Mox. He's no good trying to grab the leg of such a huge man. He won't make much difference. His legs are too big, too far away. Yeah, Moxley did a great job of collecting the wrists, and that set him up to deliver those stomps to a prone opponent. Oh, man. Yeah, these forearms are waking up King, I believe. The lariat. Brody comes. Ooh, swinging on mess. Oh! Come back or what a crash. Skin on skin, flesh on flesh. Uh-oh, uh-oh, pile Brody. driver. King, pile driver. Mike Crown, a new AEW interim champion. Moxley, a push, 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 push. Go. There we go, there we go. Moxley out of desperation, instinctually able to kick out. But boy, how much does Mox have left in his tank? He's, he's hanging look, on. He, yeah, he's very, he's in tough, tough, oh. tough shape. Brody, he changed, he changed his grip. He's Get looking to put, put, put Moxley to sleep. Get that rear choke, and Mox realized it Get ran his back into that buckle. Remember, folks, stay with us here, but stay with this main event as long as it takes. Brody, Brody King keeping his grip on Mox. Oh, oh he's, he's trying to choke him out. out. He's pulled Moxley off the mat. Oh, my God, all of his weight. John Moxley just... John Moxley just put to sleep by Brody King. That's all it takes. It doesn't take long for that hold to be on. This is going to be controversial because some are going to say this match should have been stopped right there just a moment ago. Incoming! Whoa! Wow, the cannonball! He don't miss this time, does he? No, sir. Brody New King! Champ. New champ. One, two, no! And JR, I mean, Brody King, he had the sleeper on in the ropes, but he let go before the referee's five count, and now he's looking for the Fire Thunder driver, but Moxley escapes! Oh. Boy, you, you got this, this guy, when he's vertical, he'll kill you. Just talk about Brody Lee. And Bro, Brody King, nobody there. Brody King, and I'm now sorry. Moxley, the roll up, the high stack. No. Let me get your DVR set so we can go past this 10 p.m. Eastern hour. Get him set. Moxley goes underneath. Oh. oh. Paradigm shift. Just like that, out of nowhere. But Moxley so slow to capitalize. Well, but it slowed down King for sure. Slowed down Brody King. Mox needed that. What's Mox looking for now? He's, He's probably going to drive those elbows in. There, there you go. The hammer and anvil elbows. Moxley, the point of the elbow on the point of the jaw, Lord Regal. But it's, it's not better, working. It's better to be the hammer than the nail. But Moxley changes grip. He's looking for the bulldog. He's trying. Yeah, he's got to try to sit through with that. But oh man, he's got the legs in now. And Moxley, it's a lot of weight. Mox, not a little man. And the and you see Brody King. He's he's doubling he's over. Fading. He's fading. But oh! oh! 
And that's going to break that hold up and maybe a few other body parts. Yeah, it could definitely break it. Oh. A lot of tenacity of just rear choke here. The head was there, the neck was there. Mox taking full advantage, but can he maintain control with Smock his grip? Brody, he, he, he turned the go. hips. Moxley turned the hips, and now he's got that bulldog choke in now, guys. Moxley's belly button to the sky, and Brody going. Can't. He's going. Go. His face is getting discolored. His eyes and the are match. rolling back in his head, and it is over. It is over. Moxley wins. Moxley wins by submission. Paul Turner had no choice but to call for the bell and stop the match. And John Moxley, in his first defense of the AEW Interworld Championship, is successful.